friends, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I will teach you running stitch. Let's see what and all material is required. Come, come. This is cotton thread, anchor company. This is frame, scissors, scale, chunky, tubes, beads, needles and fabric. This is glass marking pencil. If you go with light color fabric, you use pen or pencil. Let's start. Here I draw the line. This is the starting point where I wrote 1. Get down here 2. Come out 3, like that you should do. This distance should be equal. I finished this line and same thing I did here also. In this line I am going to show you another color how to use. So start here one, get down here and come out here like that. In between the gaps I am going to fill with this work. Now I did two parallel lines here. This gap must be equal. Okay. Now I am going to show you how to weave in the, with the other color. Okay. Start with one. For these lines I used three strands of thread. Now I am using four strands of thread. Now you take the needle like this, reverse and go through like this. Don't use, don't take fabric, only these threads. Again like this. Now I am showing another variation in the same stitch. Okay. Let's start at the starting point here. It, this, here is the one. Okay. Start here only. And now again take reverse. Go like this. Again from downwards to upwards. Here also I used four strands of thread for weaving. You can use six also. 
it looks nice only already I did here running stitch for this I am showing how to use beads for uh, weaving beads I use, used ordinary mission thread one strand that is enough start with one here I wrote Insert one bead, go through second line, second line, this is first line, no? so this is the second line, go through like this, now again take one more bead, now third line, reverse direction, upwards to downwards. So it will come like this. Now I am going downwards to upwards. Now upwards to downwards. I am not using fabric, I am taking only this thread, that's all. Downwards to upwards. If you want more beads, this size, size you can do, small size you can do. Application of running stitch in design. Already I did here all the three petals. Now I am showing the this petal. Always first finish the outline. Okay, let's start. taking very little fabric that distance is not equal this outline now I am doing this middle line
Let me finish it this line also. Now I am filling only one side of the petal. For special appearance, I am doing only one side. I am leaving this place. Already I did here outline. In the middle, I am going to do with beads. Sorry, tubes I am taking now. I started here. Just take little fabric. Again running stitch. If this design is bigger, you can go through chunky also. Edit this flower also. Here I used double shaded thread. Here I used two colors of threads. One is peach color and white. You can leave this place also. Otherwise you can use the other color also. In the middle I did stone here. While using stone here, one circle kanta work you should do here. Oh, I forgot to tell you. If you do like this, it called running stitch. If you apply the design, it called kanta work. I did here kanta work with so many colors. I used chemki also. This is the final look for the design. I will show you another design also. This is the fabric. Self design is there. I highlight that running stitch with black color. It looks so special. I hope you enjoyed my video. Like my video, subscribe to my channel, comment in the comment section for special videos. And take care. Bye bye.